Hi guys, so my name is Yolita Brilliant. I'm the owner of Brilliant Massage and Skincare, and today I wanted to talk about the Chestner's Peel and what are skincare peels. Uh, they're great at regenerating skin. Chestner's Peel peels in usually uh, contain ethanol, lactic acid, salicylic acid, and resorcinol sometimes, and citric acid, but not all of them contain resorcinol. And um, not all of them have the same strength in terms of acids, but pretty much all peels, even well, the Jessner's peel, even enzymatic treatment, or different peels that you've heard, TCA, you know, PCA brand peels that we use, and um, different brand peels, um, they usually use acid, you know, from fru fruits or milk, lactic acid, you know, from fruits could be citric acid. They have kojic acids for brightening effects. Pretty much they're acids that kind of eat away the outer layer of your skin. They can be different depth. Now they're going to penetrate deeper if you add more layers or if they're stronger concentration. I personally like not the strongest concentration peels, but peels may be medium to lighter because you can build them up you can add more layers if you want them to be stronger or you can do them more often without uh, li with little discomfort because they're not going to be as stingy. Your skin not going to feel like raw and inflamed for the next day. You won't have as much crazy peeling, but you can do them more often. You'll see the same result as from that one crazy peel that you had to. Even at dermatologist's office, you know, with the very strong peels, they'll put people under anesthesia, you know, to avoid that discomfort of your skin pretty much burning. So um, I personally really love peels. I've seen great results. If you have acne, if you've had discoloration, melasma, hyperpigmentation, scarring, that is the best thing that will clean up, clear out your complexion. Um, now, uh, some people um, should not be getting peels pregnancy or uh, if you have dark skin tone, it can sometimes cause hyperpigmentation, even scarring. Never you want to peel, you know, um, if you've been using retinol, you have to stop retinol for a certain time, depending on what brand, how deep the peel is, but some of the rule maybe a week, you know, like a week, five days, a week, or even a little bit an after peel too, before and after peel, like five days to a week or more or less, depending on your skin condition and, you know, the strength of products that you're using. But you know, you need to take those things into consideration. And also very important to wear sunscreen, not be outside, not go in the saunas, pools, you know, right after peel or even before the peel. So, you know, there's certain things that you want to take into consideration, but in general, they are safe for mo most people. Now, also, only very mild peels could be done. People that maybe have some rosacea or no peels at all, there are certain kinds of light peels that you could add on certain areas, but, you know, professionals will be able to assess that. Now, there are on Amazon, you can buy, like, those home peels, and while I don't recommend them, there's an option you could learn how to you know, maybe safely to do them, but if you do get them, make sure to get them from the best brand that you can and that you're following safety procedures. Don't add too many layers. Test, do a patch test, see how your skin reacts. Just a maybe small little piece. Do maybe just one layer and make sure you don't ruin your skin. But I recommend better go to professional because they'll have the tested, you know, FDA approved or um, just the knowledge too, you know, it is just not only the the peel is also knowing they will know what which peel would be the best for your skin. So I appreciate watching. If you have any questions, you can comment them down below. I'm on Instagram and YouTube and you leader brilliant. And uh, if you like to get a peel, you're welcome to do so at um, our office in Burlington, Vermont at Brilliant Massage and Skin. Um, we're doing their massage therapy, skincare beauty, makeup, retail, and we have our online shop as well for our beautiful skincare products at yolitabrilliant.com. Have a brilliant day, if I haven't said brilliant enough yet. <laughs> okay, let me know if you have any questions again, and if you had any specific experience with the peel, post them down below. I'm interested to hear if you love them, like them, hate them, have painful peel or not. Let me know, I'm curious. And now.